I can't stress enough how important grounding and bonding all of your racking and all of your components on the roof is. Uh, for those of you out there that might be DIYers and think it's a, a step that can be sort of overlooked or ignored, uh, it can't. It's very important. It, it's due to safety. Um, if at any point you pinch a wire on the roof or anything metal on the roof gets electrically energized, which is extremely common in solar. Somebody pinches a wire under a module, um, squirrels come up here and chew the wires, something like that, and a hot wire touches metal, it needs a way to clear that ground fault, to follow that ground wire, you know, back to the source and trip a breaker or an overcurrent protection device so that it de-energizes the system until you can hunt down that ground fault and fix it. Um, if you don't, what happens is you've just got a solar panel or the racking up here energized with high voltage DC current, um, just sitting here energized and it doesn't clear a fault. The system just keeps running. Everything seems like it's fine uh, until someone comes up on the roof and touches something the wrong way. They become that path to ground and get electrocuted, fall off the roof. Um, you know, I just, just can't stress enough. Uh, high voltage direct current is nothing to play around with. You have to ground and bond everything electrically 